Let us pray. Holy Spirit, fill us with peace and joy. Surround us, dear Lord, with your love. Hold us tight as we seek to be in your presence. As the days pass and we are limited on where we can go and whom we can see, the days have been long and lonely for some of us. We give thanks to you, our constant companion and comforter, an ear to listen and a spirit to comfort. On the days when our head knows you are present but our hearts do not, we pray for clarity and connection. May we be assured of your ever-present spirit within us. Remind us that you bless all that can call your name, and that is within us to pass these blessings to others. A phone call, a visit, a note of encouragement, an email, a shout out on Facebook. We pray for the reunion of our church family, the vision to propel us forward, courage and safety when we return. Be with our return to church team as they sort out the details. Remind us to be patient and tolerant of changes. We are thankful for all, all our church volunteers as they work diligently to maintain our place of worship and service to our community. We hold the family and friends who have suffered through death and illness due to COVID, cancer, and other life-threatening disease, accidents, and tragedies. Be with the people of Beirut as they deal with the aftermath of the devastating explosion. We pray for the people and families on the fringes who have lost jobs, businesses, and support, and face new obstacles, daycare and school challenges for all. We need courage and must support one another. We hold up Jim and Sue Brandt and their family on the sudden passing of their niece. Comfort and give them strength. We trust in your power and mercy to provide us with all we need, each as unique as the next. Keep our eyes on you, Lord, and may all that follows flow from you. Please join me in the Lord's Prayer. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen.